had a finish. As you can see, I finished the C by Annie By Fashion. Um, it wasn't the best canvas. Uh, the drills kept sliding around and popping off and everything else, but I made it work. So now that we have a finish, as you can see, it is sparkly. And I have it taped on the wall so that it will flatten it out so that when I go to frame it, it won't be all bulged out in the frame. So I leave it on the wall for a few days so that it will essentially flatten itself out from being stuck to the wall. And then I get a frame and frame it up. So since we had a finish, you know what that means. That means it's time for a new unboxing. Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today, as you saw, we had a finish, which means we now have a new unboxing. Actually, I have two packages. One package actually came yesterday, one came today. So we're going to open the one that came yesterday, which I know where that's from. This is from Archer's Arts. I think that's how you say it, Archer's Arts. And for those of you in the diamond painting community, if you don't know who or what Archer's Arts is, it is a company, or I'm not sure if it, one girl runs it or her family runs it or something. Either way. They sell these cool little drill accessories. And if I can get it open, right away, if I can get it open, I'll show you what it got. Now, I already know what this one is because I ordered this, but I wanted to show you guys how cool this was. All right, so I got this, which you'll see there's marker on my hand because I literally just blacked out my name on the packages, but I got this and it says, thank you, comes in this cute little bag. I love personal little touches like that. They included their business card and it has instructions. So this is a diamond grinder. For those who get the canvases, a lot of them have uh, diamonds that stick together. You put the diamonds in to the diamond grinder and you twist and boom, your diamonds aren't sticking together anymore. Had to buy that. Most people buy more than one. I'm not sure. I only have one set of hands, so I only bought one. So yeah, so that was our first package. It was a diamond grinder. Now, I honestly think that these are a must have. I can't tell you how many projects I've done where the diamonds stuck together. And my husband's kind of an experience in that now with the diamond painting he's working on now. So this will come in very handy. So thank you, Archer's Arts. If you don't know how to get one of these, I will link it down below. They are a great company, great customer service. They get a five-star rating from me. Like, I absolutely love this, and I can't wait to get using it. So, that was our first package. And I waited because I didn't want to do just one video on the Archer's Arts thing. Not that they don't, they're not worthy of one video because just the little personal touch alone is worth it. But I knew I had this coming in today. So, I kind of know what this is. I think I know what it is. I talked to a woman named Rachel on Facebook a couple of weeks ago, and I had completely forgot about it, to be honest with you. Normally, I'm right on top of my packages, but I completely forgot about this one. I ordered this November 23rd. It shipped November 23rd. I got it today, which I believe is October 5th. Um. So, yeah, like I'm really excited to tear into this because... Like she was saying about, you know, I was trying to figure out some shops on AliExpress. I had never shopped on AliExpress before. So when I mentioned about, you know, shops in a post, she commented and was like, check out this shop. You know, I have a lot of great stuff. And I was like, I'll check it out. So I ordered a couple of things. So I think I already know what this is. So we're just going to try to get into all this tape. And it's in a box. If we can get through all the tape package good I'll tell you that but we all know the US Postal Service likes to have boxes for breakfast so the box is a little dinged up that's all right I'm not here for the box I'm here for what's inside the box so this is what it says on it oh sorry I'm shaking you guys sorry don't get sick on me now nice cute little pink box 
So let's open this bad boy up and see what we got in here. Now, I don't remember what sizes I ordered. I don't remember exactly, like, a whole lot about this order. I just remember ordering two canvases. All right, there we go. All right, so we got our standard uh, tool kits. We got the drill pins, which look like they have a five or six multi-placer on it. We got our Ziploc bags. We have our wax. We have our green boat and the little tweezers, which looks like there's some moisture or something in there. Nope, that's just a bag. My bad. So yeah, so we got our tweezers, our boat, our baggies, our wax, and our multi-placers on our pins, which I like that a lot because not all of them come with multi-placers. And then the first kit I'm going to try to find is this one here, which you can see my reflection. Hello. Um, this is a lighthouse with like a wave crashing and all that fun jazz. Look at all those colors. Oh, I can't wait to tear in that bad boy. And then this one, actually, my daughter picked this one out. My daughter is a huge Mickey Mouse fan, particularly Mickey Mouse Pirates. She loves that episode with the Mickey Mouse Pirates. So I told her she could pick out a canvas for mommy to do. And that's what she chose. So that's what she got. Now, she's not going to be the one doing it. Um, if you were on my Instagram last night, you saw I literally had the whole family, including our friend slash dog walker uh, diamond painting. I ordered some little kid kits off Amazon, and I will link them down below because if you have kids and you diamond paint, and you, I know your kids have asked you once or twice to diamond paint, and you're like, oh gosh, no. Well, these little kits uh, you get, they're like little animals. The ones I got were little animals, like they got like a panda uh an owl a dolphin a giraffe i think there was like five of them for like nine dollars it was amazon prime available and they got here with another shipment of stuff i was ordering for other household stuff but uh the kids absolutely love them but the best part about them is they're stickers so they were able to not only have their work i mod podged them so that my daughter would stop picking her diamonds off i mod podged them and then gave them the sticker, and now, like, my son has, like, this diamond-painted dolphin that he made on his TV, and my daughter essentially was trying to eat hers, so I put hers away. So, yeah, so let's look at this. Now, they're rolled up, which I've never experienced a rolled-up canvas before, which it's not a big, it's not a problem at all. Like, I love the fact that it's rolled up. That just means I should hopefully not have any issues with it. But, uh, yeah. And it's on a foam roller, which I've never gotten a canvas on a foam roller. I usually order from, like, Diamond Art Club or something. They don't do foam rollers. So it's nice to get the foam roller because I was watching Kicking Cancer's Butt with Diamond Painting by with Ella. And she loves the foam rollers, and she had a great idea about using it for her drill pin. And not that I have arthritis in my hands, but that's a cool tip for those who order stuff from China and get the foam rollers. Use it to put on your drill tip to make it bigger so that you have something bigger to hold on to. So that's brilliant. All right, so it looks like this is a 40 by 30. And that's what it's going to look like again. That's the lighthouse. And I love the fact that it has the DMC. It even says, so I don't have to sit here and guess. It even says it's the DMC colors. So it has a list of the DMC colors. And that's a, that's a lot of colors. <laughs> I'm not even sure how many colors that is. But luckily for me, this company uses a freaking inventory sheet. And as you know, Leisha loves her inventory sheets. Now, I don't think the paper is cut. So, I'm just going to pull this back just a little bit. Bang with me. Let me see how clear this canvas is. The glue is nice and tacky. I'll give you that. Jeez, oh. And it doesn't come out far. The glue only comes out to probably about right here. So like mid alphabet range, which is fine by me because that just means that I can stick my uh, diamond painting boat on that so it doesn't shift or move. But look at how clear those symbols are, guys. Like, wow. And that, I believe, is a cloud. So we're going to pull this back and we're going to lay this bad boy down. And obviously doing this on a bed isn't your best bet, but... To get it to stop rolling so I can actually look at it. We're going to just peel back a little piece of it to take a look. These canvases amaze me right now. Like, 
I cannot, like, look at that freaking lighthouse. Oh my god. I cannot wait to work on this. And I'm looking at it through the sunlight. I like to use natural light whenever I do these. So you're seeing it in natural light, not like my fluorescent light bulbs from my bedroom or something. But look at the clearness of the canvas. There's no bubbles. There's no rivers. There's no creases. No nothing. Like, that is absolutely perfect. Can you see it? Can you see the lighthouse? I love lighthouses. So... I've been dying to get that one in. So that one looks absolutely perfect. So there's one. Make sure that gets on there nice and good so that we don't have any exposed spots. And of course I didn't put it back down correctly. But I didn't rip the paper, so that's a plus, uh, A plus on me for that one. All right, so now let's look at the Mickey Mouse crew because um, I haven't told my daughter I got this one in yet, and I'm not sure if I'm going to work on this while she's home, because if I do, she will hawk eye me the entire time. So this one is the same size, except for it's a 30 by 40, so it goes this way instead of long ways. And it is rolling up pretty good there. Ooh, I really hope that I didn't just... Oh, God, no. Please, no. All right, anyways. So this is what it looks like. It's Mickey Mouse and his friends. Again, with the clear codes and DMCs on there. And from the looks of it, I'm not going to have any trouble... Besides with this one. E. I'm. I don't know if you can see that very well. Hold on. Let me get up here so I can actually see it in the camera. Okay. So that one might give me issue in that one. Where here it looks clear. When I'm actually looking at it because I'm colorblind. It actually changes the color of that to my natural eye. So it to me that blends in. So I might have a little bit of issue with that. That's not on them though. That's on me. So I'm going to look at this canvas because there's a crease right here. And I really want to make sure that I didn't like do that myself. Because on the back, it is absolutely perfect. There's no rivers, no creases, no nothing. So I'm pretty sure that's just where the paper is bubbling up because I keep messing with it. So let's open it up here. We will open it up together. All right, Leisha, get it together. And actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this foam roller right there. Keep it there. It's real tacky. I give him that. Oh, look at it, you guys. Now, this one does have, looks like, nope. Nope. I'm looking at it. I don't see anything wrong with it. I thought there was a little thing right there, but that's just a crease from the paper. That's not a problem at all. That was because of me messing with it, not them. This canvas is absolutely perfect. Look at the symbols on that, guys. Isn't that adorable? Oh, she is going to love that. She loves Minnie Mouse. Oh, my goodness. And, of course, I will link her down below because this is awesome. I will definitely be ordering from her again. Um, her name is Rachel. Rachel. And I believe the store's name is Manahai or Manahue. Like, I'm going to butcher it, so I'm just going to I'm, I'm just gonna link it down below. You guys can check it out for yourselves. She has a great selection. So please, please go check her out over on AliExpress. And I had this direct line to me. It took exactly 13 days. I'm impressed. I am freaking impressed at not only the canvas. Look how sticky that is. Like... Like, okay, so get, there we go. So, yeah, it's tacky. I'm creating all kinds of issues with my canvas, but look how clear the symbols and stuff are. Like, that can't, that's, a, that's a perfect canvas to me. Like, I can work with this right now. But I'm going to wait to work on it because I want to make sure she's in school while I work on it because I'm just going to surprise her with it and hang in her room. So that was my Mickey Mouse one. Get it all flat here. And I actually have more diamond paintings coming. And I know I said I wasn't going to do that, but I was offered a really good deal because a lot of the canvases that I ordered from China um, have not been arriving when they air mailed them. So I've had to order more than one at a time so that they would get direct line to me. So there will be another two unboxings, three unboxings that I know of in the future. And... I work pretty fast, so I don't think it'll be an issue as long as you guys can keep up with me.
So let's take a look at these diamonds, shall we? Let's make sure there's nothing like popping out here or anything like that. But the canvases themselves, I already give that five stars. Those canvases are absolutely perfect. No wrinkles, no rivers, no... Like, I watch a lot of YouTube videos, and I'm always cringe when I see these women get these diamond paintings that are filled and riddled with rivers and creases and, you know, all this stuff. Like, ugh. All right, so. Oh, look at that. The number's at the bottom instead of being at the top or in the middle. That's going to make it easy to read. Now, on this one... You know, that's not their fault, but the machine must have been running out of ink. But I can obviously tell that's 3012. Like, come on. And then don't worry, I won't bore you with inventory. Plus, it looks like it's already been checked. Look at that. So, where normally, which this says, and look, they even knew there was a mistake and they corrected it. You see that? Now that is awesome. That's how I know somebody actually paid attention and checked this, and they just weren't going down and checking. They made they made a mistake, and they corrected it. So, kudos to them for that one, because I don't think I've seen that before. But, yes, you have your instructions here at the bottom. They tell you about the diamonds. They show you the canvas, and then, then oh my goodness. Okay, so Mickey Mouse has 50 colors. That is the most colors I've ever worked with. That's going to be fun. But look at all the pretty colors. One color I was actually hoping to get was, uh, and don't don't think bad of me, don't judge my life choices. But I've seen so many people get this color. Sorry, safety first. Put your put your knife away, Alicia. I've seen so many people get this color, and I really wanted it. It's six six six. It's a deep red, and where I have trouble seeing red, I'm honestly wondering if I would see it. And look at that. The mistake they made. They fixed it with some tape. I don't even mind that because at least I know I have them. And for that one, it says I'm supposed to have three bags. Count it. One, two, three. Boom. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. Oh, my gosh. Again, the colors are nice and bright and beautiful. I absolutely love that. Let's check on my lighthouse because I think that's the one we're going to get started on next. And the way this will work was you'll see two drill with me. You'll have the unboxing. Two drill with me, and then we'll have a finish, and we'll move on to the next canvas. Will we do them in order? Probably not. I'm random. I, I'll do them whenever order I want to do them in. There's a couple of them that I've been really excited to get, and there's one. I'm not going to tell you about it, but let's just say that no matter what I'm doing, I will be stopping to start that one. It is gorgeous. And don't worry. I'm not going to mix up the diamonds. I'm going to put these over there. I hear you yelling. I'm not even going to take these ones out the bag. Oh, a couple bags of three tins in there. Ooh, that's a pretty purple. You see that? Is that bag 340? It's a really pretty purple. But we have our inventory sheet. And it looks like, again, they went through and checked to make sure that I had all of my inventory. That is fabulous. I love it. I, of course, will be doing inventory just to make sure because, you know, again, they tell you to trust you or trust them. They weigh it. They this, they that. And then you go to do the painting and you're halfway done with it and you're missing diamonds. Yeah, no, not today. I just had to order more diamonds for another canvas that should not be spoken. And I'm not very happy about the amount of money I had to spend to replace the bags that were missing. Anywho. So, yeah. So, that is Rachel's Mani... I want to say it's Manicue store on AliExpress. Again, I will link them down below. Thank you so much for watching this unboxing video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget if you're not already subscribed to hit that subscribe button and that bell to get notified whenever I randomly put up videos because let's face it, it is random. And then I will see you guys in my next video. One more shout out to Archer's Arts for the amazing drill grinder and a shout out to Rachel's Rachel's Manicue. I want to say it's Manicue. If it's not, I'm so sorry. Again, I'll link it down below. Thank you so much for the beautiful canvases. I cannot wait to get started. And I hope you guys are having fun drilling whatever your diamond today or diamond painting today. Again, Miss Crochet and Coffee signing off and you guys have yourself a great day. Bye.